Today's video is kind of like an informal kind of like to do video um, of course it is all about hair as always but you know you ever have those days when you're just tired you really don't feel like doing much so this is one of those days I just kind of want to downsize myself and really not do too much but create some wigs so with that being said that is the reason why no hair no makeup today it is just basically my time to chill and relax I really want to take a nap because I'm super tired. I have been up since 6 o'clock this morning and I'm really tired. But before I decide to take a nap, I did want to start this video because I do want to get into making this hair creation. So you guys know I love AliExpress. It's like one of my favorite sites. You can get basically anything on there. And so a lot of hair reviews that I've been doing lately are from AliExpress. I have also been doing um, just black owned business hair vendors as well. But the majority of that I get is from AliExpress. So for those of you who are wondering, well, what is the best vendor? There are so many of them on AliExpress that you can just pass them up just like that. Just like that, you can just pass them up. So it's really best to just read, watch, and just keep your ears and eyes open for the vendors. So with this particular vendor, we decided to do something curly. And I wanted something a little bit different. Um, normally, you know, I do like the really, really long hair. And that's cool. But um, some people like shorter hair. So I do try to cater my videos to just basically everybody. You know what I'm saying? Regardless if I don't think I'm going to like it, I really try to cater my videos to everybody. I decided to get some short, shorter hair. 16 inch curly hair. Originally, it was supposed to be their kinky curly hair. But I ended up getting this which is basically their curly hair. This curls a little bit tighter, but in no way are these kinky at all. This is the Jerry Curl, is what it's basically supposed to um, mimic Jerry Curl curls because they're really smaller, but the hair is more or less like a silky texture. Now, this is from Jolia, and I think that's how you pronounce their hair, but I will make sure to put their link in info below. So it's Jolia Hair on AliExpress or AliExpress, whatever you guys want to call it. You guys know what I'm talking about. And, of course, it's three bundles of 16. Now, I only got 16, three bundles, because I really did think that it was going to be kinky hair texture, but it came to me as a silky version. So, each company has their own version. They think, uh, some feel like because the curl is tighter, that the hair pattern is going to be kinky, but it's really not. It depends on the texture of the hair. So, this is more or less, um, as I just look on the bag, it has the JC Human Hair Natural JC 16 inches virgin virgin human hair the the numbers are rather the letters you, if you know hair then you know what it stands for the V stands for virgin HW human hair and natural and JC and then 16 of course it is the length so the JC has to stand for jerry curl because a lot of these websites or uh, store vendors do sell jerry curl type hair and it doesn't mean that the hair is naturally thick or um, coarse it just means that the curls are a little bit tighter so a little bit kind of like jerry curl but in a more silky version so this is the virgin human hair jerry curl natural color and if you're wondering what is the origin well it is brazilian well, when i got the hair i was shocked i was like super shocked that it was even mailed um in the United States. So it came in a priority mail envelope, it's a flat rate envelope, and it came from California. So obviously they have a, you know, one of their factories or vendors or what have you right there in California. Also got a closure, and the closure is, uh, I requested a 12 inch, but from the looks of it, I think this is, well, let's say 12 inch, so. Mm -hmm. So I'm really trying to do something a little bit different with this hair. And, you know, I colored the last one that I had red. And then I colored one like a blonde. I really don't want to do too much color because when you have curly hair and then you start doing all kind of things like bleach and chemical processing, you don't have a curl left. 
you do not have a curl left. And I really don't want to lose any type of curl with this hair. So as for the curl pattern, the hair looks really, really great. I've had this for like a week now, and it looks really great. Um, when you run your fingers through it, it does get a little bit fluffier and bigger. So of course you don't want to keep these uniform curls in it because then it just looks so unnatural. And for those who've asked me, and I've said this in a few videos, yes, I do wash the hair. I wash it after I've created the wig. If I was to get this sewn on my head, you best believe I'm washing this before it gets thrown in my head and I think a lot of people have been asking me because they've seen other youtubers who have been doing reviews for Aliexpress or whatever vendor and they just say they don't wash the hair they rather see the hair in its natural state and let you see what it looks like and honestly that's really not the hair's natural state when you get it like this it's really not because the, cur the curls are uniform and whatever kind of processing or coating they have on this hair it's in the hair so you really do want to wash this out so it's really not in its natural state so I think the best thing to do is to wash the hair because the curls are going to form totally different it's going to smell much better the sheen and luster are going to be there and you're going to be able to tell if it tangles or not or, you know what I'm saying or sheds that's the reason why you wash the hair I just me my personal preference I just think it's nasty um, and I'm not trying to bash anybody but I just think that it's nasty if you don't want to wash hair like that you you know what I'm saying like oh so you got this and it came all the way from across seas and it smells like a little rancid. And I'm not saying this does, but why wouldn't you want to wash it? Like, why would you want to hair, wear the hair out there? Then you really can't do an honest review because you're saying it's body wave. When you get body wave hair, it's really wavy. Like, kind of like, you know, it has like that S kind of shape. But when you wash it, it does not look like that anymore at all. So that's kind of, to me, like an unbiased review because you have not washed it you don't really even know what the hair really is supposed to look like you just gave me the package look that you don't know if there's bugs you don't know if it's dirty you don't know what they've done to chemically process it you really don't know so why would you want to put that on your head so either way yes i do wash the hair to me i just find that it's very gross if you don't wash the hair and i like to do it after i've created the wig i sit there and i wash the wig the cap everything gets washed you know what i'm saying because that's just the best thing to do it's clean so yes, please wash your hair. Please wash your hair. I'm pretty sure this is going to turn out to be a really gorgeous wig. I've never had a curl pattern like this, a jerry curl. So I like these curls. Now I'm wishing that I would have got it a little bit longer. Onto the closure. It's a 12 inch closure. I don't think I've ever had a closure that's curly this short. And it really doesn't look like a 12 inch. It looks like a 14, but whatever. So it's a light lace. And you guys can like see right through this. This is a really good closure. Like impressive, hey, yes, yes. And you guys cannot see what I, well you can see that. Do you see how clear that is? Like, oh, no filter, baby, no filter, seriously. Please wash your hair, no filter, okay? And I don't really know what I'm gonna do to it at the end of the day, but either way, we'll see. I guess you guys will stay tuned for that. <laughs>